Hey everyone, welcome to our latest mobile office van tour. Our shop is currently packed full with mobile offices in production, but today we're going to show you one of our latest creations, a mobile office van that we did for a nonprofit. I'm excited to share with you its state-of-the-art electrical system, as well as climate control capabilities and modular design. What that means is that you could drive this van anywhere, work out of it, take meetings, and you could do it in all seasons. With its modular design, you could also move tables and benches around depending who you're bringing with you and who you're meeting with, but you could also take it all out and use this van as a cargo van. I'm gonna pass it off to Oliver, who is the co-founder, as well as the head of productions, and he's gonna dive into the details. Thanks, Arthur. Right behind me, I have an awesome mobile office. It is based on a Mercedes Printer 170 wheelbase, which is the one that is actually slightly longer. It is all in white because it's gonna get fully wrapped with the graphics and color of the company that we're building it for. It is in presentation mode, so awning fully out, and the TV is swinged towards the outside, which is a perfect situation for your team to do an activation on the ground. Uh, follow me inside and I'll give you a little bit of a tour of the layout that we built. So the first thing that we think is really important is the utilization of the front cockpit. So both seats swivel, which creates a utilization of the space in the front, and it creates a really nice space to work on your computer. We actually hardwire all the communication and power into the walls. Right at the bottom here, you're gonna find that you have four outlets, the HDMI connection that send the signal to the TV, it is directly into the wall, so you don't have weird cabling going all the way to the TV. Opposite of me, we have a bench seat. That bench seat is DOT approved, which means that if you have extra two team members joining you on the adventure, they are fully safely buckled up with a three-point harness. Follow me in the back and I'll show you a little bit more about the back of the van. Right in the rear part of the van, we have a secondary workstation. It has a bench seat, a table, and it gives you a little bit more room if you have more people working all at the same time. Let me show you how modular this space is. This is perfect in case you are going to an event and you need to carry a big pop-up tent or anything else. So let me show you that all the tables are removable. So you swing them out of the way. And then the bench flips up. So you put a cushion on the other side. You actually flip down these legs and they go fully flush. And you have a little strap that holds everything in place. This is adjustable, so you can put the cushion as well here if you need more space on the other side. Let's do the similar process that we did in the back. So you lift the table, unlock the leg, leg goes flat, table gets removed. And then this, it is on a swivel. So you go at the bottom, you unlock the leg, and you go fully flush, and then you push it back. And if you need a little bit more space, you can actually lift the bench like that, and then it goes fully flush towards the bed. This is huge space. So if you have a 10 foot pop-up tent or anything really long, this is perfect. Let me show you as well, and tell you a little bit more about the design in the back. If you can see at the floor, we have l tracks which can totally help you to strap things down so they don't fly all over the place when you drive. And the back of the van, it is actually a wheelchair accessible ramp. Okay, in the back of the van, we have a Tommy Gate hydraulic uh, cantilever lift, which is, this is industry standard for all wheelchair and accessible ramps. Let me show you how it works. So we like that it's a cantilever, so it gives you still full access to the right side of the door so you can go in and out, still having a full size ramp. So all you have to do is, you know, get the remote, activate it, turn down the ramp, also, it's pretty cool. And you get to the level where it has to be. You're gonna expand it. And then you're gonna continue to just lower the ramp. You go down until the cantilever hits the ground. It will level and then, if you can see, the angle changes so the wheelchair can actually go in. The last tip is opening the secondary door. And then you go up with this ramp. You go all the way up. Whoa, that was powerful. When it's fully settled, you bring down the two ramps. So you connect the space. 
Let me show you a little bit more about the electrical system in this van. We always use EcoFlow, which is an amazing all-in-one solution to power your office on the road. We've been using these for four years. They're so easy to use and they come with five-year warranty, which is a no-brainer when you actually need to run your business out of your office. Uh, towards the back, speaking about connectivity, we have Starlink, which is a satellite internet. This gives you super fast, reliable internet, which is the most important thing to run a business. Cell phone clean signal, which is a WeBoost. It makes your calls clear when you are in some parts and remote parts of the countries. All the way to the bottom, you're gonna find the EcoFlow components. Everything is so simple to use with the touch of a button. It can be controlled from your phone or as well from the monitor. This is a perfect solution to keep an eye and control all your systems and see how much battery you have left. On the left side, it tells you how many hours or days in this situation you have power left. And then on the right side, it tells you about your inputs and outputs. Speaking about inputs, this is a perfect way to talk about our smart generator. This is EcoFlow smart generator that senses automatically when your batteries go lower than 20%. So it turns itself on and it charges the battery up to 90%. It can actually output a lot of energy and it's really quiet in the back of the van. We actually sound insulated the box where it lives. So no vibration, no noise, nothing can actually come inside of the van. The generator, it's a nice peace of mind to run all those like appliances that takes a lot of energy. On top of my head, we have the Dometic AC. This is a really nice and effective and powerful air conditioner. It can run for days and it gives you just a really good peace of mind that you can keep your space nice and cool when you do business. In the front, we have the Mexer fan. This creates a really nice cross breeze when you don't need the AC. Underneath the seat, we have a Wobasto heater, which is taps into the diesel of the vehicle. And then to top it off, we are in the front area. We have the drive-in rear view camera, which makes this amazing van driving so much more easier. It allows you to just see those blind spots because it's kind of a long lane. Let's talk about storage. On the upper part of the van, you have a bunch of upper cabinets. We've got three more. So plenty of storage to put everything that you need. On the bottom, you're gonna find the printer cabinet, as we call it. You have three big drawers. You can store anything you want. And also, don't forget that we build custom vehicles. So you can customize and configure everything from the ceilings, wall color, flooring, benches, different color, anything that could actually reflect your brand better. If you want a fridge or water or a sink or a separation wall in the back so all the storage can be separated from the living space, we can build a few. As always, you can find us in the heart of Brooklyn. We are at 344A Mauser Street, and you can find us at brooklyncampervents.com. Thanks for watching.